baada ya kutengeneza resource sheet labda kuna vitu vingine ambavyo vinatakao vi add what you do uh, let's go ni chairman na double click nataka ku add some information nitakuja kuonekana hapa kama kuna kitu kime miss okay um naweza kubadilisha pia na change working time yake ukaandika working time yake ni muda gani okay ama kuna some notes you want to add some notes here okay so you do it hapa cost mshaandika tayari na cost accrued mshaandika kwa hiyo depends na kama kuna information yoyote kuhusu huyo mtu au kuhusu hicho kitu nakifanya na huyo chama anasikia kuna email address yake niweka hapa okay of course booking time kuna wengine wako committed labda ameshakubali kuwepo pate ya mradi lakini kuna mengine anaweza ni proposed bado hajakubali yani mko katika ideal stage hamja introduce your idea au hamja introduce your project kwa yeye kama atakubali kuingia kwenye project ama la so you can also select if it ni kama it's a person you call proposed or committed so that's how you add information um, on resources so baada hapo na click okay mambo yanaendelea So ukishamaliza sasa unarudi kwenye task kwa sababu tunataka turudi kwenye Gantt chart form ambayo tulikuwa kabla. We want to assign resources. Kuna namna tatu ya consign resources. Namna ya kwanza ni ukivuta hapa kidogo utaona kitu resources. Naona resource names hapa. Mm -hmm. So task A labda anahitajika chairman kwa hiyo utakachofanya hapa na select okay. Huyu ni chairman anahitajika una enter. Kwa hiyo ina maana task A anahitajika mtu chairman anafanye hii kazi. Okay? Kama task uh, let's say task task I labda ina inahitajika uh, material flan. Kwa hiyo you do the same thing. You select truck So that's one way of adding resources. Lakini kwa inaonyesha na nyingine kwa add resources. Uh, task I unaweza kufanya double click. Okay? Uki double click itakuja ile task information form, utakuja sehemu hii hapa resources. Then hapa una uh, una select nini? Truck. Hii hapa truck ambayo itatumika unit moja. Then you press okay. Kwa hiyo moja kwa moja inaonekana tatumia track. Okay? So that's another way of adding uh, resources. Na mara nyingine unaweza ukaamua kufanya hivi. Let's say um, task ya mwisho. Okay? So what you do you go to resource then assign resources. Okay? So labda we administration utaskije utaskije huyu hapo nataka kwa assign administration afanye kazi let's say salary na uh, secretary afanye kazi hiyo kwa hiyo una select administration naona hapo ni select administration then you assign alafu na close automatically imeonekana hapa umesham add kama sivyo unataka kumuondoa unaweza tu ukamfuta tu hapa au tutumie tu ile njia nyingine tuliokuwa tumeshaonyesha kabla you select this task okay then you assign resources then you select the task ambayo uko umemwasaini mwanzoni una remove alafu una close so that's how you you can add resources to the task i hope mpaka hapa imeeleweka tuendelee kwa pamoja baada kwa sign resources tuta, tuendelee kuona video zingine namna kufanya tracking of your project